Hello, this is my Evidence 2 proposal. The class is Analysis of Electrical Circuits. Uh, my name is Roberto Carlos Montañas Ferra, and the teacher is Luis Carlos Felix, Felix Erran. This is the circuit that we're going to be working with. We have a 2 voltage, a uh, 12 volts uh, voltage source, 2 6 ohms resistors in, in series and one four ohm resistor in parallel and we also have a two amperes current source. Uh, the first thing that we're asked to do is to convert that the last circuit into a northern equivalent circuit so we decide to use a super mesh between I1 and I2 so that the current source doesn't cause any problems and we use Kirchhoff voltage law to get three equations that will be later um, solved and will give us the value of current in each, each mesh. Uh, because it's a Norton circuit, we have to close the A and B terminals that were uh, previously open and that will create a current of a short circuit current that will be the one that we're going to be using um, for our Norton equivalent uh, circuit. Uh, when we have the three equations, well, our short circuit current will be one of them. And if we solve that, we have, we solved it in, in MATLAB and it gave us that uh, ISC will be of 2 amperes and lastly to solve this problem we have to calculate our equivalent resistors and we have to uh, sum the ones in parallel and sum the one over the resistor for the ones in no we have to sum normally the ones in series and we have to sum one over the resistors the one in parallel and at the end, we have that our equivalent resistor will be 3, amp 3 ohms. And this is the one at the bottom. The, that will be our northern equivalent circuit. A 2 ampere current source in parallel with a 3 ohm resistor. Then we are asked to what is, will be the fastest way to transform that northern equivalent circuit into a feminine equivalent circuit. And that will be with source transformation, which is just using a, a the Ohm's law. And we have that a, if we have a current source in parallel with a resistor, is the same than a voltage source in series with a resistor. So we use that knowledge to calculate our voltage source which will be our current source and our resistor multiplied, that's Ohm's, Ohm's law, that will give us 6 volts, and that will be our thevenin, this one will be our thevenin, um, our thevenin uh, equivalent circuit. It will be a 6 volt voltage source in series with a 3 ohms resistor. Then we used Falstad to calculate that, that we have the same uh, amperes and the same voltage in all three circuits. We have on the top the original circuit, and we have one ampere and three volts. Then we have our Norton and Thevenin circuit that also have one ampere and three ohms. So it's correct, they are equivalent. Then we're asked a uh, the value of RL, which will be a, a a light source, and we want to calculate the PL maximum, so that we have to use this PL general and derivate PL with respect to RL, and if we derivate that again, we have the PL maximum, and that's the formula, and we have three watts and RL will be 3 ohms. And lastly, we're asked if we use a 2 ohms or a 4.5 ohms, which one will be hotter? 
and if we use that in the PL general, it will give us the exact same value, so it will be the same, 2.88 watts. And that's all. Thank you for your attention.